we are still in the time of COVID and we should not lower our guard yet. In the first reading, we heard the continuing story of Tobit and Anna and their son Tobiah and the healing of Tobit and the uh, with, uh, getting the wife for Tobiah of her, yes. This experiences narrated from the Old Testament can give land understanding to the gospel reading for today which presents to us the reality that even though the, the, the Jews uh, had this great respect for David he is not the son of God and that was underlined by Jesus preaching in the gospel we can interpret that as a deepening of our understanding for who is God for us and oftentimes especially during these times this time of the pandemic we rediscover God through our own pain through the pain of the others whom we see suffering and because of that we discover a loving and merciful father and from that from that experience our capacity to be merciful and compassionate is once again awakened generated so that we continue the love that we have understood from our, our from our experience of pain and suffering and made up pushed us or probably moved us closer to the father who is that loving and merciful father that helps us in time of our need that was the experience of tobit experience of anna experience of tobiah through the archangel Raphael. today as things are getting better we should not neglect this lesson oftentimes when things get better we move away from god we become focused on ourselves our desire to fulfill our needs our own projects and god becomes again somebody by the wayside or we invoke him in time of our dire need to be reawakened on on, uh, on the presence of god means to every day every minute every second decide to be with God all our choices all our judgments should come from this intimacy that we have learned through our pain and, and suffering and never move away from that our capacity to be human our capacity to be to form a community stems from this from the Father who loves the Son and the Son loving the Father and the Holy Spirit the formation of the community based on the Holy Trinity that capacity to give that capacity to understand the other that's the meaning of the gospel for today to know God to know Yahweh to know God the Father through not only through our learnings in the Bible, but through our experience of pain and suffering there, we are released from that when we trust our painful experiences in the caring of the Father. In Matthew, Jesus says, Come to me, all who labor and are burdened, and I will give you rest. And in the Psalms, Yahweh's compassion is repeated as the rock of our salvation so today as we reflect once again on the experiences of Tobit Anna and Tobiah and the conversation of Jesus with these uh, Jews our knowledge of God is 
depends so much on our capacity to be intimate with the Father and the Son and the Spirit. And oftentimes, this experience would pass through pain and suffering. 